Okay, I'm going to show you how to use Pivot. So right now, that I'm circling, this is Pivot, and I will open it, and maximize it. And by the orange dot, you can move around the stick figure, and by the red dots, those are like the limbs that you can bend the stick figures. And after you put it in the position that you want to, then you will click um, Next Frame, which is down at the bottom left corner. And then, uh, yeah, you can. I'm pressing spacebar right now to move the. to click on the next frame button. It's a little bit faster. Oh, shortcut. You can play it, speed it up, slow it down. Um, went to a new file. That was kind of weird. Yeah, and you can, um, load figure types that you've created or downloaded off the internet. And I'm going to get a um, Master Chief, which I downloaded off droids.org. Show you that later. Master Chief. Kind of looks like Master Chief. Good enough for stick figures. So I'm going to move his legs around. And. Get out something else. Uh, let me see what we can load up right here. Maybe a weapon or something. Object. Hmm. BMX. BMX bike. That's cool. Okay. BMX bike. Load. And yeah, then you can um change the size of items that are big. And I'm going to put it on 50. And I'm going to make the uh, normal stick man. Write it. Delete that other slide. Okay, he's gonna sit down. Put his legs in the right position. Other leg. Hands. Lean forward a little bit. Okay. Here we go, let's run Master Chief over. Okay, next frame. Go click on that. And remove the bike. And then you have to remove the stick figure too. And next frame. Remove the bike. And the stick figure. And next frame. Bike. Stick figure. Next frame. Put his hands up like he's trying to shield himself. That'll be funny, right? Okay, let's on that. Next frame. Move the bike. Hitting Master Chief now. I'm gonna bend him a little bit. Move him back like he's got hit. Next frame. And then he's gonna bend him a little bit more. Move the bike closer. Next frame. I don't really know how this is going to turn out. It's probably not that fluent. Okay. And then, uh, once you get to the point where the stick figure needs to go off the screen, then you will just delete it. And then I'm going to keep moving this closer. And then I'll delete them. And I'll hit next frame. So here it is playing it. Slow it down a little bit. Speed it up, slow it down. You know. So you can play around with this and what you make with stick figures. And then what you want to do when you're done, you want to save it. You can save it as a pivot file to reopen it and edit it and add things to it. I would recommend doing that first and then going back and saving as a GIF file which you can load onto like Windows Movie Maker and edit it and stuff. So yeah, you can pivot. Oh and then the bitmap is it it'll save like all the separate frames of the pivot. Each frame. And I'm just gonna save it as a pivot for now.
to stop that. That's because of the ink. Oh, oh, and um, you can uh put backgrounds in different backgrounds. So let's go hit new, 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 new. Gotta hit new. Uh, background. my backgrounds where my backgrounds are and you can put um I have some different backgrounds this is a black one this is sh like a street corner I'm gonna use that one and then you can put the stick figure next to you no just make them walk and I'm not very good at making stick figures walk I don't really really usually make stick figures walk cause it's kinda stupid Anyway, usually they're riding like a vehicle or something. Yeah, you know, I'm just making this, this file, making them run or walk or whatever you want to call it. It's gonna look really retarded though, because I'm not very good at it. And I don't really need to be, because I don't like making stick figures walk. See, he kind of looks retarded, but yeah, you know. Speed it up, slow it down. Oh yeah, and there's a little repeat button. Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road Time grabs you by the wrist, directs you where to go So make the best of this test and don't ask why It's not a question but a lesson learned in time It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life So take the photographs and still frames in your mind Hanging on a shelf in good health and good time Tattoos and memories and dead skin on trial For what it's worth, it was worth all the while It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life Something 